Hello, welcome back. If you're new here, I'm Romika Spiegel Jones, an illustrator and designer based in Manchester. So this was one of the daily prompts. I had a lot of fun with this. I didn't use any reference for this specifically, but um, yeah, I can really see this on a different design, maybe on a print or on a product. I just really enjoyed doing this and I think they look really cute. At that time I also tried to figure out what kind of colored pencils I want to buy, new ones, because I didn't have any neutral tones. And that was my little... I didn't feel particularly great. Um, I have to say, like I've said before, you will have ups and downs in this course. And don't be surprised if they happen, because I do think you are one of many who has them, and I had them as well. So this was like a little diary page kind of. I share this with you because I feel like it's important to understand that yes, it's a wonderful course, but it's very challenging and you should prepare yourself for that. Um, that you might doubt yourself at some point and you can feel really down. There was a day I was felt totally destroyed. And yeah, felt really, I compared myself a lot, but it's okay. As I think as long as you don't get stuck in this pose, um, in this, no, I'm talking about poses all the time. Go, don't get stuck in this um, mental state. Then it's all right. You know, it's it's okay. Sometimes we have these days. Anyways, on that day, I actually because I was so down, I felt like I want to go to the next level at least physically. Um, so I started to lift 20 kilos for me. This was the first time, and it was very heavy because I'm just starting out. But yeah, you know, I felt like by pushing myself physically, I felt I could overcome this negative mental uh, state and it really helped me. Yeah, so you just need to learn how to deal with your own um, struggles in a constructive way. And then, yeah, here you can just see an artist's life. When I lose patience and start to compare, meaning when I stop to work hard and just compare myself with people who have done much more work. <laughs> It's, um, now I can laugh about it. Back then I felt really... Uh. So yeah. Anyways, so I did some poses of how I felt. And I used it as exercise and it was actually quite good. I think at that time I really felt much better. Here's some other things. Okay, and then I think this was the... Yeah, this was another prompt. And this was a kitchen table. I didn't like this so much. But I really enjoyed this one, the top top view of this kitchen table. Um, so cut onions and I didn't even realize, but my mom pointed out to me, oh, this must be a left-hander. Can you see left-hander? Because we see links hander in German, so I don't know, but you know what I mean, right? And I was like, yeah, that's true, actually. The way this is cut indicates that. And I don't know, just always a new way of thinking to me, like, mm, that actually can mean different things and depending on how you um, put a carrot and make it look like it's chopped on the left side, probably indicates that this person used use their left hand. I was like, well, I don't know, this is maybe just a random little thing, but I find it quite interesting that I didn't even intentionally did that. My mom just pointed out to me that I actually did that. So, yeah, I enjoy the colors. I enjoy the composition. I find, yeah, found it really joy enjoyable. And this is the time, the first time I used my new colored pencils. And I just want to give a sh very short um, shout out to my pencils. <laughs> I don't know if you can do that for inanimate objects, but um, so these are my colored pencils, um, Durban Drawing 24, and these are all. Um, soft pencils for drawing nature and skin tones and when I saw this they actually had all neutral tones um, I might make another video about them specifically but I was I was in this art shop for a really really long time and I'm really glad I found them and these are the colors um, some of them are out at the moment but yeah these are my I really enjoy them so far just that, you know, that's what I'm using now, including my other pencils. So 
the tones are really nice. Now I have finally some neutrals, or at least I have choice. And I might overdo them at the moment because <laughs> I don't know. I'm just tapping into them. But so this prompt was both. And yeah, I tried different things. This is all just from my imagination, except for this one. I had a little bit of a reference with that. Mm -hmm. 